in the case of Nicole Hannah Jones, she had such pride about returning to an institution that had given so much to her, had given her an opportunity, the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. But she was not willing to take that post uh, with, frankly, the crumbs that the board wanted to allow to fall off the table um, as if it were, I don't know, her privilege to be hired. Of course, she considered it a personal privilege, but she's a well-credentialed and qualified woman. And the fact that It is that experience that then led her to an HBCU to me just further affirms why this legal theory of critical race theory is so important in this moment, which simply asserts that it isn't just racism, that it resides in the individual that has to be addressed. But the reason why, despite 50 plus years of post-civil rights, that Black folks still don't have a fair and equitable seat at the table has everything to do with the fact that institutionally racism has been ingrained. 